But now I really do think it's done. No, it's not. <laughs> Hello everyone, Ashley here with Ashley Tolman Art. Great to have you back. Thank you for stopping by. And you know, I won't dilly dally and let's just get into it. So today I have something that you can do that will absolutely level you up in any industry that you're in. I understand that this is a this is an art channel, but no matter what business you're in, you do this and I promise you you will level up. I want you to reflect in these three ways. Number one, ask yourself what went well. So with that question, I want you to list everything that went well, everything that went well that day. Um, to the extent of like, I like the brush that I picked or I remembered to think of cool tones and warm highlights no matter how small, write it all down, all the good things. That brings me to step two. Now I want you to ask yourself what went wrong. And I get it, that can sound a little harsh and it's not what went wrong, it's just what were you unhappy about? I want you to keep this one concise. Say like three, that's kind of the magic number with things to work on, is if you pick three, it's e the easiest for your brain to digest. So. Let's say pick three things at the end of the session that you weren't super happy with. Great. So then that leads me to step three, which is asking yourself, how do I improve that? I want you to come up with a solid solution of what you can do, what you can think about the next day or the next time you have a session of whatever very clear, very concise way to solve what went wrong. You do these three things and I guarantee you, you're gonna reach the moon and beyond. So to recap, what went well? What, what went wrong? How do I improve for tomorrow? This is looking really good. I added a bunch of shadows back in here because I had originally gone in and just kind of added some white and then it was too white and um, diluted I guess so I added some more shadows back in there and I really like it it's still too dark in comparison to the reference but I would prefer that because then that allows me to go back in with white and kind of make it look a little bit better. But yeah, I kind of feel like we'll probably finish it today and then just kind of move on with other stuff. But right now I'm just making sure that everything that needs that feather texture, a little more subtle. So with this painting, I keep taking photos and then seeing what looks good and what doesn't look good. <laughs> As of right now, it's looking very close, if not all the way done. This just helps me see any like last minute things that kind of draw too much attention. But yeah, honestly, I, I feel like this is done. But yeah, when you can, when you see it up close, there's so much little, there's so many little details in the, the feathers. Okay, it's done. What was I saying? Oh my gosh, I see a little bit more. Hold on. That's fine. This is why I do this. This last little bit is like my, my chance to be like, oh, it's done. No, it's not. Oh, it's done. No, it's not. But now I really do think it's done. No, it's not. Okay, it's done. <laughs> I really do think it is done now. 
It looks good. It still looks painterly. It's still hailing outside. All right, well, that's a wrap on this painting. Thank you again so much for stopping by and hanging out with me while I painted this. We are new to Patreon. It just started. Um, I'm gonna be adding a bunch of stuff monthly. There's way more behind the scenes. You'll be able to vote on things. We do coloring books. There's monthly activities. Thank you to all my patrons so far who have joined. I appreciate you so much. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I'm so excited to watch that family grow and just create a space that all of you guys want. That's, I, I look forward to that. I hope you enjoyed and I can't wait to see you in the next one.